Hello and welcome back to my Let's Play of Card Apocalypse. This will be episode number 33, this time for real. <laughs> As you might have noticed, I've uploaded two in between episodes before this one, because, well, I guess we are pretty close to the end of the game and I wanted to make all the improvements to my deck that I could. Um, but yeah, it was like a total of one and a half hours, a bit more than that, of um, trading, deck building, applying stickers. Um, so yeah, might have been a bit much, but you don't have to watch those episodes or you can just skip through them. Um, just so that you are not confused about the changes in my decks. But yeah, in this episode, we'll continue with the story and we're gonna do it right away. So let's check out what that clue up there is telling us. Let's inspect the, the shed and um, also see uh, what Coach Armstrong is gonna do if we try to enter there, because I think she was guarding the shed. Yeah, let's see. <laughs> what? The lock is busted. It looks like it was melted? Hey, no kids allowed in the shed. Go play some jump rope. <sighs> I gotta find a way to get in there. I need a distraction. Find someone to distract Mrs. Armstrong. Okay, we have some options here, or we don't. No, it was just uh, just the trading options. I confused for options to distract her, but down there we can talk to Ashley. Let's see if there are any other options. Probably not. Just the spot quest. <laughs> nope. No other options, so let's talk to Ashley. I have a plan and I need you to not interested. Oh, come on, Ash. Last night you said you would help me if I needed it. Well, now I need help. Yeah, with what? I need you to cause a distraction so I can check out the shed. Ooh, that I can do. <laughs> check out the shed, finally. <laughs> I need a real good distraction. How about you pull the fire alarm? I am so proud of you right now. You go check out the shed and I will pull the fire alarm as you get there. Okay, go team! Team Ashley. <laughs> My mom says there is no me in team. There is if you move the letters around. But Jess, before you go I got one kinda important thing to say. I got this feeling that once you go in that shed Things are gonna get serious. Okay, this is probably prepa pre preparing more me for the point of no return. So, yeah. <laughs> Maybe you should... What? The cat behind my back just suddenly jumped up. Maybe a bad dream. Everything alright, Mr. Cat? Aww. Maybe you should make sure you have done everything you can before you go for it. Yeah, I've done that. <laughs> I was expecting this. So, yeah. I've done everything I can. So now, let's go. And unleash my pipsqueak decks on my enemies. I already told you, no kids near the shed. Oh, come on, what happened to the plan? 
Find out where the plan went wrong. Hmm. Let's speed this up a bit. Ashley, what happened? You've really done it this time, Miss Juberman. I didn't do anything. Yet. She was going to pull the fire alarm. I would never do anything that would inconvenience teachers and students, Miss Wieners. It was her and Jess. They had a plan. I heard them talking about it earlier. You're a stinky liar. You have always been a stinky liar, Megan. I don't think I'm the stinky one, Trashly. Don't you dare. Trashly, Trashly can't buy lunch. Trashly eats out of a garbage truck. <laughs> that makes no sense. This doesn't rhyme. <laughs> yeah, right. <laughs> that doesn't even rhyme. Hello, Mr. Cat. Welcome back to the show. I'm glad we are not friends anymore. I never want another friend like you. Or any friend. Ever. You won't need to worry about friends when you're all by yourself in summer school. Sorry, Mr. Cat, but this doesn't work right now. Can you come down here again? Hey. <laughs> Cutie. Hmm. Please don't hug the microphone. That sounds horrible on the recording. Chip, chip, chip. Come here. Okay, step on the cables. And throw things down. Thank you for that. <laughs> Maybe go back here again. Okay. He doesn't want to, apparently. <laughs> I'm sorry for this. But... Yeah, he needs some attention. Summer school? Last time we had to ask your mom to come in and attend a meeting about your behavior. You were warned that the next time you were caught breaking school rules this would happen. That's what you get for trying to pull the fire alarm. Uh oh. It's not Ashley's fault. I was going to pull it. Megan was going to pull it. You're such a kidder, Megan. <laughs> try to take the blame or try to play it down. Maybe this will somehow work out. You're such a kidder, Megan. Huh? Oh, we're always making up fun games and pretending. Yeah, like yesterday Megan said she was going to put playground gum in Mrs. Wiener's lunch. You what? But, 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 but... Oh, don't worry, we were just kidding around. Weren't we, Megan? Yes, kidding. <laughs> We're just a bunch of kids being wacky. Yep. Well, okay then. Come up with better ways to spend your time. Do your homework or something. Oh yes, Mrs. Wieners. Right away, Mrs. Wieners. Nice try, Megan. Ha <laughs> ha Ah, it's not fair. Really? Hey, so I guess I want to say thanks or whatever. Did you just thank me? Can we not make this a big deal? Jeez. So what are we going to do now? I still need to check out that check out the shed. I have an idea. 
just give me a head start and then go check it out. How are you gonna help me cause a distraction without getting in trouble? I have my ways. Come on. Really, seriously, get into the shed. <laughs> You are about to end the day. This may result in some activity. Yeah, okay. We do want to continue. Hey, miss, I have a question. Yeah, what is it? Where do babies come from? I, uh, well, I don't, uh. Nice job, Ashley. <laughs> It will take her forever to explain how storks transport babies. Okay, let's get ready for the showdown. I'm in. Don't let anything stop you. I won't. I knew it. I knew something was going on in here. The boss said, no interruptions. Get out of here before the shine from my precious, uh, from my glorious gems binds you. Police, precious. I'm here to get my friend back and you can't stop me. I'll crush you so bad that when I'm done, you're gonna be a diamond. Nah, you're not. Let's play my TikTok deck once more. <laughs> Prepare for 1000 carrots of pain. Bring it on. I eat carrots for breakfast. Yeah, took me a second to get that wordplay. <laughs> okay, here are my duplicates. And my talk attacks. Wait, what does this do? Okay, plus one maximum food. I think I might not need it. But we'll see. Okay, so I have four food. And I can play the blight eyes. And attack with it right away. And, well, this is about as quick as I have expected the stack to be now. Okay, <laughs> I feel really a bit overpowered here. Traditionally, the goal of the game is not to die. Wow, what a pearl of wisdom. Okay, I think I might have made my deck too strong. <laughs> what? No! I don't lose! I can't lose! Go crawl back to the rich lady's purse you get, you get carried around in. You're nothing but a pile of pebbles. Ooh, up there is the Deadly Dungeoneer's book. Okay, new rules. Minions with ambush cost one more, hidden costs, changing prices, minions with morph cost one more, inflation, minions with swarm cost one more. I'm not gonna play morph minions, so let's, um, let's uh, choose that one. One doggy down, one to go. Come on, Wolfgang, you big loser. I'm gonna destroy you the one way I know how. With power pets. Jessica Carter. Get out here right now. Uh-oh. Hmm. Just what do you think you're doing? Saving your butt and the butts of everyone in this school. 
I was showing kids what not to do. <laughs> I was just playing. Okay, let's get serious here. Saving your bot and the bots of everyone in this school. How exactly are you doing that? By defeating evil. Hmm. Ha! What are you doing? Jess! Why is the principal being creepy? I think she's laughing? You really are a stupid child. Hey, you can't call her stupid. You're a teacher. I'm the principal of this school. I can do what I like. I don't think you can. I think there's a page in the school handbook that says... If you don't shut up, I will give you an F. I... Um think that this is not fair. You can't give Cedric an F for no reason. Ugh, go cower in a corner. Eek. Okay, that's it. You crossed the line, Principal Hardass. Yeah. It's not fair. That's enough. All of you, to my office, right now. Okay. For the third time in one week, you're in my office for breaking the rules. What do you have to say for yourself, Jessica Carter? I would like to step in and speak for Jess. Excuse me? She will speak for herself. Well, she hasn't exactly got the best record in these situations. Plus, my parents might send me to law school, so I have been practicing. I'm glad I broke the rules and I would do it again. If you listen to us, we wouldn't have had to break the rules. We're not done yet, not by a long shot. So... Um... I'm glad I broke the rules and I would do it again. I'm not gonna say that one. If you listen to us, we wouldn't have had to break the rules. We're not done yet, not by a long shot. Yeah, let's choose the second option. Uh, that sounds like a reasonable choice. If you listen to us, we wouldn't have had to break the rules. You hit another student on your first day destroyed the cafeteria and now you have ignored teachers orders and entered staff only areas of the school objection cedric hearsay this is a waste of time i will be contacting your parents jess to organize moving you to another school what no! I want silence! Jess put everyone's cards in the box. But... Right now! Hmm. Get out of my sight before I expel the rest of you. Now, what are we going to do? We have no cards. That's it, man. Game over. That's it. The final straw. I've had it. The power pets have taken everything. Is Jess okay? I think she's going mega. <laughs> they took my goodish school record. They took our cards and they took our friend. We need to stop them, no matter what it takes. But Jess, they said they were going to move you to a new school. That won't happen. I won't let it happen. Plus, they can't, 
because there's no more accessible schools in the area. <laughs> I'm with you. Me too. I'm so there for bringing down these puny pets. But how? We come back after dark and break into the principal's office. Eek! We take our cards back, get to the shed, defeat Wolfgang and every champion we come across. Then, finally, we get Jacob back and save the world. Sounds like a good plan. I'm in too. Let's meet outside uh, let's meet outside the school after dark for Operation Card Apocalypse. I'm so glad you moved here. So am I, Ash. So am I. Also Friday, the final final countdown. <laughs> I could be watching Power Pets, but no, we need to save the world. What took you so long? Sorry Ash, there was a tiny problem. How long could you possibly have been waiting? Hold your horses, I'm here now. Sorry Ash, there was a tiny problem. I'm not allowed out on school nights. I had to try and convince my parents that there was a sudden surprise sleepover at Yolanda's. All right, Cedric, you made it. I told my mom I was staying at your place. What did you tell your mom, Ash? I didn't tell my mom anything. What? My mom doesn't like getting all up in my business. Oh jeez, I regret this already. Way to go, Sam. Did you see Yolanda? I heard her from a mile away. Fear not, the amazing Yolanda is here. Sheesh, this is meant to be a secret stealth operation. Oh yeah, secret, stealthy. Come on guys, this is our moment. We've been training for this for days. We'll be amazing heroes. We'll defeat the champions and save our friend. We'll show all the grown-ups what happens when kids are in charge. We'll defeat the champions and save our friend. Friend, but I get it. We can do it. We need to do it. And Jacob would do the same for us. That's right, yeah! Let's get revenge. Let's get our friend back. Let's play some power pets. <laughs> yeah, let's focus on the important stuff. Let's get our friend back. All right. Now, how are we going to get in? You didn't plan that far? There's a secret entrance at the bike shed. But how did you know? Don't ask. <laughs> All right, let's go team. How did you know the gate was unlocked? A magician never reveals her secrets. Who knew Ashley was such a badass? Everybody. Haha, <laughs> you said it. I can't believe that we are actually doing this. I can't believe how weird the school looks at night. Yeah, it's all so... Weird, whoa, what's that? The power pet champions are up to something. Can you see what's out there? I can only see shadows and a heckload of goo. 
Come on, let's get out there. Let me work my magic on this door. Huh? It's open. Weird. Then let's move. Jacob is waiting for us. You guys scout out the playground. Check if anything will stop us getting to the shed. What are you going to do? I'm gonna get my cards back. Infiltrate the school. Done. Get your cards from Harding's office and save Jacob. Alright. Seems like I probably can only go to the principal's office while the map is telling me nothing at all. So much goo. Okay. You! You! What are you doing here? I'm here to get my cards. Me too! Harding caught me after school. Outside the school. I didn't know teachers could do that. Wow, this is getting out of hand. It's locked? No! Who would have keys to the principals? The janitor! He has to have a set of keys in his closet. I bet one will work on Harding's door. Nice! See ya, loser! Hey! Wait up! I bet there is a champion in the janitor's uh, room. But no, there isn't. <laughs> I was wondering how we would have... Uh, fought against that champion then without cards. The keys are all the way up on that shelf. So near yet so far. I can't reach up there and you definitely can't. We could work together I guess. Too bad your goons aren't here. Yeah, we could work together I guess. Together? You know, as a team. Ah, forget it. I don't want to work with you. Yeah, you know, as a team. Why? Then we both get our cards. This isn't a trick. Not everyone is a jerk face like you, Bruce. All right then, but if you drop me, I swear I'll... Just hurry up and grab them before I change my mind. <laughs> I got him! Nice! Let's get our cards back. Okay. Great, let's head to Harding's office. What's taking so long? Bruce, what are you doing here? He's helping me get my cards back. The power pads really did alter our universe. Forget it, come on. All right, let's go. Let's keep on playing and head to the final, final countdown. Are you ready to enter the Dragon's Lair? Let's get those cards! Alright. <laughs> we are in! 
This is awesome! Look at me! I'm Principal Harding! Shh! Let's, let's just search... <laughs> Sorry. Shh! Let's just search the box and get my cards back. Our cards back. Yeah, yeah. Hmm, not here. Oh, wait. Yes, got him. Sweet. Dude, what about mine? I have yours too, Bruce. Told you, working as a, as a team would pay off. Now we can kick those pets back into their own dimension. Uh, I was just a bit distracted by the stuff that was confiscated. Like, um, there's a crossbow, um, a d and player handbook, lots of cards, um, and like a butterfly comp. I don't know what it's uh, pronounced like, but yeah stuff to the, the thing to like comb your hair don't know how it's pronounced but you know what I'm talking about so yeah lots of interesting stuff in there <laughs> um, now we can kick those pets back into their own dimension what oh didn't you know about the power pets plan to kidnap every kid and use them as a source of energy in order to enslave humanity and end the world as we know it um, no? Yeah, that's a thing that's going on now. I know you probably need my help, so... Oh my goo, is Bruce going to be nice? Wait for it. I... wanna help. Wow. Just... wow. Let's not jinx it, yo! Come on, we should get back and see what the others are doing. Okay, but can I really quickly leave something for Harding to find on Monday? No, yo, we have more important things to do. Make it quick! <laughs> yeah, make it quick, this might be good. <laughs> <laughs> that evil face on Yolanda is awesome. <laughs> Regroup with the gang. Yeah, I'm really sorry that I was distracted before that uh, cut I had to make. There was lots of stuff going on, like um, first, as you might still see, as I probably, as I'm probably not gonna cut it out, the cat was uh, walking over like um, the table and yeah bumping into the microphone once again I don't know if I'm gonna leave it in or cut it out this time um, then the phone was ringing um, I'm definitely gonna cut that out and uh, yeah then someone rang the doorbell and yeah lots of stuff going on so I might have not been as focused as I would want to be but now I am so let's keep it going Come on, the gang is up ahead. Maybe this isn't such a good idea. Give me a break, Bruce. Hey guys. Did you get your cards? My cards and this tag along. Hey. Are you kidding me? We don't need more monsters in school tonight. Be nice, guys. Bruce, he Bruce helped me get my cards back. No way. Bruce is kinda one of the gang now. Kinda. What? Bruce the deuce in the gang? We need all the help we can get to rescue Jacob. So, Bruce is along for the ride. Ugh, fine. Status report, Captain Wieners. There's purple goo everywhere and a big champion up ahead and probably more. 
We'll need to beat any champions we find to get to the shed. It's going to be tough. They're out for blood. We're gonna get murdered to death. Wow, you guys really are a bunch of babies. Who are you calling a baby, loser face? You! I'm calling you a baby, baby! Stop fighting, you guys! Yes, use that anger! Look, we can fight to death once this is all over. <laughs> Not sure. Stop fighting. We can fight to death once this is all over. Use that anger. Um, ah, seriously, stop fighting and focus now. If we fight, we are sinking to their level. We've been training for this moment all week. True. We are gonna make those champions regret the day they came to Dudsdale Elementary. Let's get him! Charge! Um, what? Let's go! Wait for me! Don't leave me here! <laughs> All right, here we go. Charge the shed. <laughs> I'm thinking about what decks I'm gonna use. I <laughs> might even go back to my Meowton deck. Um, just to make it a bit more interesting, but I'm not sure about the Grim. I think, I don't know if he was minion focused at all. What's that smell? Some children come early to the slaughter. Ah, oh, no! We're doomed! I can't do this! What's wrong with her? You didn't know? Grim totally freaks Jess out. Silence! Ah! <laughs> Sneaky child needs to pay the reaper. Get away from my best friend! Sam? Did you just say that I'm your best friend? You stood up for me when no one else would, and now I'm gonna, uh, stand up for you. I smell fear. That's the smell of your defeat. <laughs> Alright, so this is gonna be interesting because we're gonna play Sam's deck. Your soul smells delicious. Stop stalling! It's only a matter of time before I send you back to where you came from. You start. Bloodspore. When your champion attacks, deploy two 1-1 one, one minions. Sounds good. When you play a card, deploy a 1-1 one, one minion. Okay, <laughs> I'm gonna get so many minions. Mega Brood. At the start of your turn, deploy a 1-2 minion with Swarm. And on Transform, deploy six 1-2 minions with Swarm. The Brood is strong. Uh, when an enemy minion is destroyed, gain plus one attack until the end of the turn. When any minion is destroyed, gain plus one attack until the end of the turn. And destroy two minions at random on transform. Okay. Um, so we kind of feed Grim with our minions. <laughs> but hey. That's what we're gonna do, I guess. Um, let's examine this. Okay, gain plus one maximum food. That might be useful. And we have the Behe Mouse. That's pretty cool also. We might even be able to play it if Grim don't, doesn't destroy any of our minions now. So, let's end the turn. Ah, of course. Okay. I think I'm gonna play the Rattan 
and pip squeaks can attack right yeah and yeah the dynamite as well and yeah i'm gonna attack yep should work fine so far okay okay now i have two behemoths <laughs> behemoths whatever so um Until the end of the turn so as long as my minions die on my turn it's not that big a problem that's good so what shall we do when you play a card deploy a minion so I'm gonna get rid of one of these and then I'm gonna play the bee mouse and the red hand gets boosted and um, the tags now I think I don't need more food right now. Okay, this is also all right, I guess. First I'm gonna attack with my champion, and then with the pipsqueak and hope that my behe mouse doesn't get destroyed at random. Things are looking grim for you. All right, red hand and the pipsqueak, that's okay. So, one more attack by a pipsqueak. And I'm gonna end the turn. Yep, it reverted back to two attack, that's good. Okay. Mm -hmm. So... Okay, so if the scratter... Okay, my Behe Mouse won't get defeated right now. So it doesn't really matter if it triggers or not, but pretty often it didn't trigger. So, yeah. Um, I think I'm gonna play Luke this turn. And uh, first attack with my champion. Then with the Behe Mouse. And didn't trigger the mutation. Okay, so let's end the turn. I think this is looking good. Still looking okay. <laughs> yeah, I think this should still work out. Let's play the Scratcher. I think it's not gonna trigger correctly when another ability is triggered at the same time. So I think when I attack with the Luke, it's not gonna trigger because it does something on being defeated by itself so I think it's not gonna trigger both but now it's a good time to test it because the Grim will either be on zero health or on minus two health uh, if it triggers correctly so let's see. Okay it just didn't go on after that but I think it triggered correctly even though my minion would still have triggered its revenge ability so I'm not sure what caused it to malfunction before I'll see you in hell child ooh creepy see you next fall bonehead all right, Sam. Woo, Sam's the man. Ugh, I'm so tired. I don't think I can play anymore. That's okay. You did great. Here, you should take my cards. All of them? Even your legendary brood? Are you sure? 
What are best friends for? Come on, we gotta get to the shed. Okay. Lots of nasty little rodents in the room. Eyes and teeth and nipples in the room. Dirty, nasty little rodents in the room. Rats in the room. Okay, I get more decks. Um, I think my decks are strong enough, so um, yeah. Um, I have minions with lethal and minions with hiding, but I think no or not many minions with stun, so let's choose total stunners to cost more. Okay. Um, yeah, I'm just gonna take a quick peek at the deck I just got, but I'm not gonna build any more right now, so... Um, I mean, it's mostly minions I already had and also like mut mutations I already had. So the only thing I could really use would be the, uh, the brute anyway and um, yeah, I don't think so. Not right now. So let's continue to the shed. It's Wolfgang. Where do you insects think you're going? Whoa, Wolfgang! Eek! Yes, it is I. Bow before your new overlord. Give us back, Jacob! Never! Okay! <laughs> um... Yeah, this is fun. Let's say okay. <laughs> okay! Uh, really? Psych! Now give us back Jacob! Oh, you will all see your friend again very soon. Phew! I was worried that he should... Uh, I was worried that he would be hurt or something. This is why I never work with human children. Well, we never work with animals. What did you call me? She called you a big, dirty, stinking animal. Yeah, an animal. Stinky dog. Furball. You guys are nuts. Quiet. I have had enough of your foolishness. Uh, I, uh, whoa. What's happening? I don't feel so good. Oh no! Woof! Ha 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 No! My friends! All gone! And you're next! No! This isn't right! If you're so tough, why don't we let our cards do the talking? You've ruined so many of my plans, girl. I'm going to enjoy defeating you. Girl, it's Jess, destroyer of pets to you, fur brains. I would say goodbye to your earth if, if I were you. If you were me, you would win. <laughs> That's a nice comeback. Okay, um, yeah, let's go with the Frankenstone deck, I think. This is gonna work. Or should we really, like go crazy here and try the poof deck. <laughs> I mean... This could work. I, I don't remember what Wolfgang does, but I think it could work and it would be funnier to make it really hard to win right now. Yeah, whatever. Let's try it. <laughs> Are you ready for your final battle, Jess? That depends. Are you ready for yours? Okay, let's check out what Wolfgang does. Your damage minions have plus two attack. Mega Wolfgang, all your minions have plus two attack. And on transform, your minions that cost five, uh, your minions cost five less food until the end of your turn. Okay. <laughs> 
Yeah, this is not gonna be easy with this deck, but yeah, I think we can do this. <laughs> um, okay, Meteor Shard is interesting right now. I'm just gonna attack. Okay. Here comes the anti catter And uh, am I gonna attack with the Gloomer? Not sure, I think so. Yeah. Boost the attack and attack again with my Poofant. More mutations for Wolfgang. Okay. We could play the snowball, but we don't have any mutations out right now, so might not be the best idea. So let's play the slick and um, maybe, yeah, maybe we should take care of this one first, boost our minions and and then take care of Wolfgang. All right. Um, I'm not gonna play the Hypnosified right now. Nope, nope, nope. Um, or, well, if the Wolfgang attacks a strong minion or any minion of mine, he will go mega and can play a lot of minions, even expensive ones. So, might be a good time to play the Hypnosified, actually. Uh, I forgot! <laughs> well, let's see what he plays, but I think we should still win if... Well, there might be Defender Minions. No. Oh, we still have the Slick. This should work out. Loomer takes care of the hot dog. Um, and I could also like use the Wesset to... Uh, what does this do? Oh, once again my minions gain attack. Good to know. Um, so, normally we should win. Even with playing the Wesset, but well, I don't think my enemy will be able to defeat me in one go now uh, in, in the next turn. So even if some of those, one of those mutation prevents me from winning now, I might still be alive next turn. <laughs> so yes, take the nope first. Let's get rid of this one. Uh, yep. Okay, I don't care for that. I don't care for that either. Okay, seems like we win. <laughs> That's great. Hope I'm not missing anything, but... <laughs> I did it! I beat Wolfgang! I am the real Power Pet Master! Rawr! <laughs> Ah, you may have defeated me, but you'll never save your friends. Where are my friends? Where's Jacob? Tell me now! Waiting for you inside. I'm sure they'll be so happy to see you. Hmm. Okay, more rule changes, so I guess there's more fights coming up. Tag team. Decks now have a backup champion. When your first champion is defeated, the backup champion takes its place. Wild cards. You can use cards of any faction in your decks. Release the clones. Decks can only have 10 cards instead of 20. Before the game starts, shuffle in a second copy of each card in the deck. Okay, um...
I'm not really sure what to choose as I've already spent one and a half hours on um, deck building I don't really want to spend more time <laughs> so well the tag team could still be interesting and I think you only add a second champion it would make the battles last longer but that's okay with me I think um, might not be most beneficial to the decks I play but it would be fun and it wouldn't require much changes like this one to be interesting I would have to really mix up the cards in my decks and yeah this one would mean yeah to totally change the layout of my decks too um, might also be interesting I like all of these, would tr like to try them out as well, but yeah, I think for now I just choose the tag team and um, yeah, check how that goes. I wonder if I can choose champions from a different faction as the backup champion as well. Well, we'll see. Tag team is selected. Guys, I'm coming! Save Jacob and the rest of the game. I'm coming, guys! Okay. Um, I've once again recorded for 28 minutes after the break, and the first part would be about uh, yeah, around 28 minutes probably as well after I cut out the um, disturbances. So, um, yeah, I think I'm just gonna add, um, like, the second champion to uh, my respective decks and then end this episode and, um, yeah, um, wait for the next episode for the, yeah, final duel. So, yeah. Okay, I that was just changing the champion. Okay, maybe I need to use my mouse once again to... What? <laughs> yeah. Now I can add a second champion. So let's see. Um... When you play a card, uh, minion deploying. Um, bum, bum, bum. Okay. Um, Frankenstoat. Um, Mega Frankenstoat would be pretty useful in the end. And the Hair Force is boosting swarm minions. I have, well, quite a lot of them. Um, I have the duplicant with natural swarm. I have the two spaying mantises and the unsatiable with swarm. So well, it's at least four, five, five. No, four swarm minions. The second unsatiable didn't get swarm. Okay, it's only four. That's not that much. So maybe not the hair force. Um, I mean, this one is really good in this deck as well. The Frankenstone is just a great champion. Um, the Brute is also nice. You play a card, deploy a 1-1 minion. Um, but I think it would be would have to be the starter champion and um, not like the second one. And I would like to keep my Tok as the starting champion. Uh, so let's add the Frankenstone and um, let's edit this again. Yeah, swap starter. Right, now I have the talk again at, as the starting champion. I will try not to need <laughs> the Frankenstone, but I wonder 
if my enemies will have decks with two champions now too or if I will have like this big advantage of having 60 health total. Um, yeah, I'm curious about that and well let's do it in reverse order here at the talk and um, need to close first I think otherwise it didn't work to swap the starting champion. So yeah I guess now we have two working pipsqueak decks again. I can also like edit the poof deck and add another champion. Um, Let's check the Sphinxster has stun and ambush and when your enemy deploys a minion deploy a copy of that minion with hasty. That would be pretty strong late game. Um, the tiger eye, your minions with charge, okay you boost charge minions, how many charge minions are in here? I think only three if I'm not mistaken. Um, and the fluffles, what did the fluffles do? Okay, boosting stun minions and I just, uh, I think, weakened stun minions or made them more expensive or something like that. Uh, so I think I'm gonna add the Sphinxster and, uh, yeah, switch them back around. Um, Or should I actually... I'll swap them back. What was the poof ability? Um, I think... not sure which would be the better starting. <laughs> I think I, I broke the deck now. I can't really seem to select it anymore. Let's try with the gamepad. Okay, this works. <laughs> it's really good to use a gamepad and a mouse because otherwise you just get uh, to points where you can't really do anything anymore. Um, but okay, but the deck is still broken, it seems. Uh, yeah, I can't change anything. Um, well, that's not great. <laughs> uh, can I delete it or anything? I know it seems that I've broken it. Okay. Um, I think I'm gonna end the episode here and uh, fix this off camera and um, yeah I hope you liked this episode um, finally we are advancing to like um, probably the final moments of this game and the final showdown um, hopefully soon we'll have finally rescued Jacob and now also all of the other kids so yeah, I hope you liked it. If you did, leave a thumbs up. If you didn't, as always, you can leave a thumbs down. Um, any questions or comments, tend to the comment section um, or like head over there. <laughs> and uh, yeah, if you wanna see more videos of mine, uh, subscribe to my channel and uh, hit the notification button to receive notifications when I upload new videos. So that being said, thank you for watching and uh, see you next time, hopefully. And uh, yeah, see you when we deal with uh, the final battle, probably. <laughs> Bye.